Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are watching another movie. This is Hero. This is our first Jet Li film that we're ever reacting to on the yeah. channel. This is the first one I've ever seen. I feel like I've seen a couple of his films at some point when I was younger, but like I've never actually really watched his subtitled film. I feel like I've seen stuff where he was like performing in English. So we do know that this movie also has Donnie Yen, mm -hmm. which we're huge fans. I follow him on Instagram and everything. <laughs> ever since It Man, I love Donnie Yen. It also has Tony Lung, I think is how you pronounce his name. He was the dad in Shang-Chi. So this is going to be cool to see him younger, yeah. you know, maybe a few familiar earlier faces on. In this yeah. movie. All right, if you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe and check out our Patreon if you want to see our full-length reaction to this film. We also do have a second channel, Dos Cavazos IRL, where we do vlogs and other non-reaction content. We've also reacted to several other martial arts films here on this channel, so if you want to check them out, the link's down below. All right, let's jump into this movie. I'm <laughs> Nameless. 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 himself to the sword. Okay. I really like the soundtrack that's going. I'm a sucker for soundtracks and like musical scores, scores yeah. and just like stuff like that, music and movies. Wow, walking in like you're on the place. <laughs> oh, shit. Wow. Single-handedly. <laughs> I wonder why he walked up mm. here and everybody showed him that respect. <laughs> I don't know how he left out. He's got a sense of urgency. <laughs> I would have fell, fell down those <laughs> yeah. stairs so fast. I do not have sure footing sometimes. When did this movie come out? I didn't look. I think I early looked. 2000s. I feel like my, mm -hmm. I don't know, I keep going to 2004 for whatever reason, but I'm not 100% sure on that one. Are they like checking him for weapons? Like if he's gonna see the king or something? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Hmm. A dagger? Oh. Is this what he wants though? Seems like duty is his motivation. Mm -hmm. And the sword. Ooh! A love story? Oh. A saucy love story. Hmm. Catching him up with like the local drama. <laughs> oh. Egg. That's not an egg, never mind. Oh, Donnie Yen. Donnie Yen. I've never seen Donnie Yen with long hair before. <laughs> <laughs> You need a soundtrack for this mm -hmm. fight. Wow. Huh. It never gets old <laughs> seeing these movies, seeing oh, them no. fight. <laughs> Gosh, I love the exaggeration. <laughs> oh shit. I love watching Donnie Yen fight. Yeah. <laughs> Especially when he fights multiple people at yeah. once. Yeah, nothing tops like I. It was the ten people he fought right in the first Ip Man. Yeah. yeah. Oh <laughs> shit! <laughs> Good luck. 
or is nameless. This has to be a good fight. I mean, you would hope, you know? Or he's gonna take him out really easily. <laughs> I'll get him like flying towards him. Okay. Because we know he beats him. <laughs> How do they feel? Is it like, are they on like a string? They're you know? wires. Yeah, I would imagine. <laughs> Oh, that's what that they were trying the to give one. him. Yeah, 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 with the fluff or similar to it. I think that was it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> no, oh, He's packing up. Back. <laughs> <laughs> Is he just gonna like walk up on the fight? They need a soundtrack. He's like, sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the same without music. I know. What is he envisioning? Oh, okay. Oh. I thought we were gonna go into his past yeah. or something. <laughs> wow. I like just like in so much shock and awe that they can move like that. <laughs> I feel like if I attempted just like one of those dodges, <laughs> I would like break something and throw out my back. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit. oh! Oh, he went too hard. <laughs> oh what the fuzz is for. <laughs> is this what does it? Oh, it's gotta be. Oh! Yeah, there goes a the stick. <laughs> did he finish him though? Because we didn't see him yeah. hit him. Or did he just bring it? Are we gonna like see how he defeated each one? Hmm. <laughs> Let's get another flashback. Let's get another music guy. Oh. I like how he's strategic. Is like the whole movie gonna be him doing flashbacks? Because that's really cool. Like him just explaining. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, she's ignoring her. Maybe. Oh. oh! What's your problem? That made me feel calm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh wow. What strategy is this? This is a sit down. Um, like getting them arrows? Okay, they're oh. gonna like sit and like shoot them up. Okay, okay. <laughs> I was like, I've never heard of a war strategy where you just like sit there. <laughs> Like, all right, let's come out at me. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, okay, they the use their legs. What? Oh! Interesting. Wow. <laughs> that's crazy if that's your responsibility. I know. Like, we just I'm need to sit you with your, air, oh, with your feet up in yeah. the air. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. oh! The fact that they could go directly through the roof like that, wow. It's gonna be a massacre. I'm trying to get out of here. There's like arrows like, still landing. 
You just gotta like walk in the door. Oh my gosh, they're all, all just going back. Or calligraphy. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, oh gosh, the one in the head. Oh my god. Interesting, like the parallels between calligraphy and swordsmanship. It's like he was talking about music earlier, too. Yeah. Hmm. Now I'm curious, is he like really on the side of the king, you know? Yeah. <laughs> How dare they mess with oh, my shit. art? Oh. Is he gonna use that? Is that what he's gonna use? <laughs> he just plucked it out of the air and just kept going. Oh, so she's flying snow. Go Snow, go fight! <laughs> I don't know. I feel like he has a lot of respect for these people that he's fighting, you know? Mm -hmm. And that's also why I feel like maybe Donnie Yen's uh, character might not be dead, you know? Yeah. Maybe it was just like to appease the king, and then he just like delivered, you know, the, the piece of his like... I don't even know what that thing's called. So this is where you start on the scroll, right? Yeah. I like how they look like superheroes when they fight. Yeah. It's funny because it's so exaggerated that you would think it would be like ridiculous, but like you take it seriously in yeah. these movies. They do it so well. <laughs> <laughs> like how they just fling up. Yeah. I don't care, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I like these movies so much. That's probably why we watch so many of these. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so is that the scroll? Like that one thing? Also, that was a massive brush. <laughs> right. Everybody's meeting in the library at midnight. If we don't see him kill them, mm -hmm. they're alive. Yeah. In my opinion. There it is. Like, what if he teamed up with them? <laughs> okay, let's hear. Oh, wait, did he show it to them first? Message. Snow, right? Yeah, they were in love! Oh, she had a piece. Oh. So did they have a thing too? Or did he have a thing for her? Because he, he looks like a little a taken triangle. back, yeah. He seems pissed. She was in Memoirs of a Geisha. Oh, okay. She's but, down. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't sure at first. <laughs> oh, oh! Interesting. What's going what on here? <laughs> <laughs> is she jealous? I can't tell. I can't no, tell that either. felt a little yeah. jealous. Like, you think they have a thing, like, now, and then, like, he just felt, like, the oh. way he did because he saw her, like, with the little piece of his, like, dagger. So, uh... Oh, well, I feel like that's the dynamic, right? 
Oh. You're so dismissive to her all of a sudden. I guess you were just trying to get your mind off of. Yeah. Mistress Flying Snow. <laughs> okay, yeah. She's very much still in your heart. You're just telling yourself lies. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't have done that if she wasn't. She was just like fixing your hair, and then you were just like, okay, let's get it on. <laughs> oh! Did he do it just him? then? <gasps> oh, oh, shit! The plot to us, the scandal, the intrigue! <laughs> Mistress So is iconic. She's a legend. <laughs> I was going to say, I feel like Nameless wouldn't have done that, you know? <gasps> Dang! Like there's a lot of honor there. <laughs> wow. That was a, there was a, a massive love triangle going on there. Mm. Is she going to kill herself? Damn. Why well, do I feel like she might kill herself? I mean, that could be possible. And then that's, he just, he came back the next day and then just found yeah. everything. And just delivered it to the king. And she feels bad. I mean, you really acted really rash. I know. He did too, but like. In like yeah. a different way, you like yeah. literally just killed him. Yours like, is like a definitive rash. Yeah. <laughs> like... You are. That is yeah. true. Very impulsive. This was unnecessary. They're both very impulsive. Are you having a moment with your ex? I'm gonna cheat on you. He's like, oh, you cheat on me? I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> like... Her dead ex too. Well, yeah. Supposed. Well, she found out about yeah. that though, so. I still like Mistress Snow, though. I like her character for some reason. She's cool to me. But when he was telling the king, wasn't this, like, his plan to, like, cause this drama? Yeah. Oh, and now she's mad. Mm -hmm. So all you had to do uh, was Is she going to kill her? But you can... Can you kill her? Boy, well, she was in the calligraphy. I don't know. Okay, I'm not going to fight you. Yeah! I don't. I think she's gonna kill her. Yeah. This is Mistress Snow we're talking yeah. about. Yeah. Like a gazelle. <laughs> she's like not concerned at all. Like where she's putting in yeah. like all the effort she can. She could kill her very easily if she wanted to. Dang. She like actually is bit, putting up a fight, A little though. bit more, yeah. <gasps> ah, the hair. How dare you! <laughs> <laughs> How's this gonna end? Unless she wants, lets herself. Maybe. You know? Okay, no, she's gonna Oh, try. no. Yeah. <laughs> See. You're gonna keep fighting, or you're gonna call it? Qu no, she's gonna keep fighting. Wow. <laughs> she has to supposedly die somehow. Or surrender. Or get the sword, I guess. So. Yeah. Maybe she just gives up. <laughs> I mean, it seems as though she's using her strength for now. But she keeps coming at her, so. Is this it? <gasps> yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. Oh. oh. That must have taken some serious ab. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Ooh. she's like she's seeing red, maybe? I can't tell if it's part of it. <laughs> mm. Interesting. Do you think she attacked so aggressively? She was... Yeah. 
I mean, if he's telling the story, it happened in front of everybody. Unless he's just telling the story, like, mm -hmm. and it's not what actually happened. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. That was so different than when she acted, yeah. though. I don't know. Maybe it's just the story he's telling him. Yeah, I'm skeptical. Very skeptical. But I also feel like we haven't spent enough time with him yet to, like, really know his true motivations, you know? What? Like, what? Is he calling bullshit? Okay. I mean, we noticed it. This is a little different. Oh. Oh. You see, he just wants to take out the king, and he just wants to get close to him. To take out you. Okay. Okay, yeah. Okay, but this is just his perspective. I like, mean, this is what I was what's thinking. What's the truth? I would have been the king saying the exact same thing. You're lying. <laughs> if sword, sky, and... I mean, snow. Snow? Yeah. If they all walk up in this castle right now, you'd be like, whoa. <laughs> like, what if they're all not mm. dead? Be came first to come. He's like practicing? Or this is, I can't tell if it's in his mind though, you know? Yeah, or this is just what the king. The, what the, yeah, the, the king's emperor. mind, like what he's yeah. like projecting. Really That's why happened. I said, like, what is the truth? Because he yeah. even changed the scenery of it all in his mind, you know? Mm -hmm. I like that. It's like the two different sides mm -hmm. of the story. Like, what's the truth? What really happened? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Be like, fake your loss. Oh, maybe is that why? But this still might just be what the king is saying. I know. So maybe they all did die, but to sacrifice for the greater cause. Yeah. Wow, I don't know. Like, was it really them saying mm -hmm. goodbye to each other, and then she killed him, and then went to go die herself? But maybe the other stuff did happen too, and it was all for show. I don't freaking know. <laughs> like with the other girl. I mean, this is obviously very different. I kind of, I mean, I kind of tend to like lean towards like, you know, this, you know, as opposed to like what actually happened. Cause there's a lot of holes in that original story, in my opinion. <gasps> What Both it, stories are <laughs> betrayal. Yeah. Well, remember, this is what they said. Like, let's die together. So maybe she's just like, okay, we'll yeah. we'll die together. Mm. Okay. Yeah, okay. Whatever it takes. It's like Black yeah. Widow. <laughs> That's what it reminds me of. Or was the other girl? That was her name, Moon? I don't remember. Yeah, I didn't catch her name. I'm assuming that that's probably her, though. Like, she probably said, like, to come help him or something like that. I would prefer, you know, going down this way because there's less treachery, yeah, you Yeah, know? less <laughs> tragedy. Yeah, still tragic. But in a different way, not yeah. no like love. And thing. it might be taking out the king, you know, if yeah. this is all part of the plan. I wonder if also there's more to Nameless's story then, you know? Because like what he explained at the very beginning, 
like it seems like he cares a lot if that is the case and he tried to you know get himself in a position all these years to take him out <laughs> Let's take like two steps back. <laughs> oh, a few steps back. <laughs> Her dress is so pretty. The red one too. Her, the red one I thought was stunning. <laughs> I was like, like, I kept looking at it and be like, wow. Like, it looks so magical as she was moving. <laughs> I loved how flowy it was. <laughs> He's about to do this begrudgingly. But for the greater cause, if this is how it all went down. Yes! Not my girl Snow! But yes, <laughs> it was for a reason. <laughs> She's my favorite character in this movie. I've decided. I love strong, badass women, female character. Women, female. <laughs> Especially when they fight. They can hold their own. But like well done ones. No Mary Sue's here. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, so like, what happened with him, you know? Mm -hmm. But he kind of brought it to them as yeah. like a, as a proposition. Still, I'm holding on to the idea that they all might not even be dead, and they just gave it, and it was all a scheme. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They gave the swords, I mean. Mm -hmm. Look at them on the water. <gasps> yeah. And also, it could be stylistic when he fought her like in front of everybody but you didn't see blood and when he fought Donnie Yen you didn't see blood either oh my gosh he was like projecting himself forward wow what an interesting fight <laughs> it's like a dance it really does feel like that right the choreography <laughs> it feels like ballet <laughs> <gasps> oh no. Do they have to go like wipe it? Like. <laughs> yeah. Oh. That's when he supposedly did it. Mm hmm. Oh! He Take the sword and leave. Oh, okay. But he doesn't have the sword on him, though. Yeah. But then again, this is also the, still the king. Explaining yeah, it's this. like his perspective. So it's like yeah. we, we don't really even know what to believe. Like, is there a third part of the story? This is what we call mm -hmm. unreliable narration. <laughs> but like. Oh, did she bring it to him, or was that him? Yeah, yeah. she did. <laughs> All right, so that's allegedly <laughs> how this went down. Oh. See, Moon didn't even want to be with him. <laughs> if this is true. Oh. Okay. So like he may have taken his own life. Now let's see if it's all true. It would be really cool if, you know, like all four of them just like a Avengers assembled and attacked <laughs> yeah, his ass. That's what I want. <laughs> like they all just show up. Yeah, I don't know how they're going to get, you know, past the gates. Oh. So was that really the truth? Murderous intent. That was, that sounds like an anime. <laughs> like yeah. what they say in anime all the time. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, motivation. motivation, yeah. But, yes, they're still alive. Come on, let them all walk out. 
<gasps> Broken sword? Is he still alive? Oh, wait. Okay, what really happened? Okay, okay, okay. Is this, okay, okay. Is this the truth? So like maybe you practice like the hit on her so that you wouldn't kill her, maybe? Let's see how accurate you are. I mean, pretty fucking accurate. <laughs> Maybe hit her in a spot where there are no vital organs? Or I guess that's just like demonstrating what he could do to the king. Wait, yeah. Okay, here we go. So they're alive. Yeah. Yes. Oh, you had the opportunity. Why? Maybe because he wants to kill him, so maybe he didn't want to kill him? What do you say? Why? What happened? So maybe she still did stab him just to stop him. You know? Because maybe that is like, you know, like the one constant. <gasps> oh, oh is this here we go! Okay. Okay, she's gonna stab him. Yeah, yeah okay, so like, like. What really happened here? <laughs> oh, damn it, Moon. And she was him, and that <laughs> yeah. was the constant there. Interesting. Like, oh, these three different yeah. stories. Different variations, yeah. kind of like a multiverse. <laughs> Just it's gotta be her, though. He might still be better than her, but he may have, like, let it happen. Oh, maybe not. I keep jumping to conclusions. Or oh, stop them. Oh, there we go. Oh, and then this is how she fights. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think you're any match here, Moon. Why didn't he want to take out the king? You no, know, he's just toying with you. Because he doesn't want to hurt you. It's interesting how like you can pick up a little bit on all the stories because it seems like Moon still kind of does have like a thing for him, like in a in a respect type of sense. Yeah. She did stab him, not in a jealousy way. Not in like I'm taking this for you. I need to stop you so we can actually do this type of way. So interesting. The three different parallel or the three different stories. She had a different dress each time. Yeah, they all had a different color scheme. Yeah, the like red, the blue, red, and the white. Blue and the white, yeah. Maybe he's just tired of like, you know, this constant like seeking revenge and stuff. Okay. Right. And this is when the king said he saw them too, right? Yeah. Because he was talking about like how they acted and like not impulsive and like their love for each other and stuff like that. Wow. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe it is feasible they just show up <laughs> and do this if they've already done it before. Look at like the trail of dead bodies. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Why did you make the decision you did? I mean, he's gonna have him dead to rights at some point, and I feel like I have the opportunity to kill him, but then choose then not for to. For some reason, him and his it's... broken sword don't do it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, 
has to be something about like not wanting to like fight anymore. But it's interesting though, like because you just had like left a body, like a trail of bodies on your way over here to get to this point and then just like stop. I mean, here's the opportunity that we talked about. Oh! Yeah, he didn't do it. Or just barely. But, but yeah. You need to be careful. <laughs> I mean, I know we're we know that she's good, but don't turn your back to an army. Like, is he like your long lost father or something? Like, what the heck? But why? Hmm? But because of calligraphy, what does that mean? You haven't given a reason. Oh. Now will he have an opportunity to kill the king and choose not to? Hmm. But for what purpose? Okay. Our land. Like everyone's land? Oh, like he wants mm. the, like, united? Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, interesting. See, that's why I, I was like tyrant at the beginning when it had mm. said that, but it didn't, the words afterwards didn't sound fully tyrannical, but who knows. Mm. But is it conquering or unifying? I don't know. I guess it's a matter of perspective. Mm. <laughs> uh, but he's like, <laughs> I'm not going to listen to those words. I feel like he's still gonna kill him. I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Yeah. I mean, he's giving him the opportunity. He's not gonna kill him. And then this is like, not in this way. <laughs> You're gonna have an audience. What made them like stampede up though? Did he do it? We're gonna see the flag. Was what like are we gonna red see? if it happens? Red if dead, yellow, yellow if, if it didn't. Yeah. It's gonna be yellow or red. I can't fucking tell. Oh, I don't know. I don't know where it's gonna go. He's either gonna be like, "You're not gonna make me join you," or he's gonna be like, "I." Agree. But also, he's not the type. I don't feel like who would just like kill unhonorably. You know, like if they're not fighting back. You know. I mean, we know he could like, you know, block some arrows. Or did that actually happen? <laughs> <laughs> that was in the first story. What are you going to do? He's either going to be like, I agree, mm -hmm. or fuck that. And it's looking like fuck that. I don't know, though. Mm -hmm. Very gracefully, he doesn't seem upset. Is this how the 10 years is going to come to conclusion? <gasps> he did it. Uh, oh, no, he didn't. Oh, he didn't do it. Yeah. Wow. Are they just going to kill him now? Let him pass. Hear that? They're going to shoot him full of arrows at point blank range. Oh, oh well, no, they're... they are. They're letting him go. Oh, wait, never mind. They just brought in more. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I mean, he didn't kill him. Yeah. He just thought about it. <laughs> <laughs> For 10 years. <laughs> Yellow. Okay, here we go.
Because I feel like if they try, he's just going to let them. He has no weapons. Are you going to fight it out? After all this, don't yeah. freaking kill each other. That would suck. <laughs> I think my weapon now is the pen. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, <gasps> oh, oh no! no! It only happened because he let it freaking happen. Yeah. Uh. You why you not Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Completely unnecessary. <laughs> Obviously the movie's coming to a close, mm. but like I feel like this would just like piss her off more to want to kill the king, you know? Yeah. I don't know if this would, like, you know, get her to see it his way or not. The moon. Oh, my gosh. She's going to be pissed. They're going to have their yeah. fight after all. What if she lets her kill her now? Ugh. <sighs> She's gonna push it through her too. Oh my gosh, yeah, she is. Damn. Just when you thought like it was yeah. gonna be like a happy ending. Oh my gosh. Oh. Now what are they going to do to him? Are they going to let him walk? What's the king going to do? But will you appear weak, you know? I mean... No, spare him! He's going to do it. They're all going to die. Yeah. Damn. Oh my gosh. This film took a twist. I know. It was like way like deeper than yeah. I expected. And there is like bits of truth. Like even with Down to the Arrows, you know, mm -hmm. like how it all ended up playing out. And they all hit him. Because all the arrows hit him instead of hitting the wall. Yeah. Uh, oh my gosh. Like, even how she s stabbed him, you know, it all kind of happened in, like, variations. Like, how the truth actually mm -hmm. unfolded. It's gonna carry that weight. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so a very interestingly created film. I like the way how they kind of like told your story, went back, and then kind of told it to you several different ways mm -hmm. until we finally got to the truth. Yeah. Wasn't fortunate how it all ended, obviously, for a lot of different characters, but I still liked it. I, I didn't know if I was at first just because like, oh, we're just gonna like, you know, kind of tell the story and then just kind of have it set in like the past as we're telling the king. But obviously when we got to the second story, I was like, okay, there's a lot more intrigue here than mm -hmm. just like, you know, the first iteration of the story. And that's when it really started to get me. Yeah, and I liked how the final story had variations of what the, the previous stories the truth, had yeah. had, you know, <laughs> um, like just different things like how she stabbed him and mm -hmm. like the arrows and just different, 
Even like the color schemes that went into it all. That was really well done. The way too, they yeah. fought, the soundtrack. There was a lot of really cool elements to this movie that I really, really liked. And like the use of fabric too and the use of textures. I talked about that in the in the movie, but that also and just like the way things were like flowy. Mm -hmm. I really liked it. Yeah, it's kinda like interesting, like I don't know if you want to call the colors harsh, but like, you know, in the first story where Nameless told the king it was like they were all wearing red. And then it switched to blue. Okay, now we're getting a little bit more towards the mm -hmm. truth. That's kind of what it felt like to me. And then obviously with the white is when we did have the truth. And then we were obviously able to see like Broken Sword explain when they had the uh, first assassination attempt on the king and then it was green. So it was really interesting how they continually changed the colors throughout the different iterations of these stories. I always really liked the fighting in these movies. It's, it's so cool how mm. it feels almost like like comical how they fling yeah. around and stuff but it's it's not though in the settings of the movies which is so interesting how it how it happens it's almost like artistic or like a dance you know yeah it felt mm -hmm. like the choreography on those mm -hmm. it felt like watching a ballet especially when yeah. they were fighting on like the lake i felt like that one was like really like choreographed really yeah. well it did feel like i was watching some sort of ballet or something yeah i really liked watching because it didn't really feel like fighting it was but it felt different and mm -hmm. i thought that was super cool about this movie and there was also elements uh you know with like um when the first iteration of like you know nameless telling the king like how it happened when moon was fighting snow with like all the leaves that was kind of a thing mm -hmm. and then when obviously snow went out to go like block all the arrows she was like using like her her dress or whatever you want to call that part of her dress to like block off all the arrows and stuff it felt kind of superhero-esque, like mm -hmm. what you said. Those are very interesting tropes in a lot of these martial arts films. All right, well, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye, everyone.